So hi everybody and welcome back to our Blender tutorial for absolute status. We are creating very simple basic assets. We are exporting them to Unreal Engine 5, which is to released yesterday. And of course we will create again a fast simple object and test it out. So let's get started. First of all, we delete our light, we delete our camera, we don't need that. And what are we going to create today? Yesterday uh last time i created a hat month hat, something like that very simple and a table yesterday and now what we are going to create let's create um, anything simple right and um let's press shift a interesting is here on the mesh when we go we have here a monkey hat but here we are creating not really anything we just getting the monkey head <laughs> and then placing it on top of it okay let's see let's make something like a um statue or something like that with this monkey head let's do it so we go here we grab and set and we put the monkey head on top so now i have a monkey head uh anything and i can show this this is already something. Of course, we have we did nothing here actually. Just <laughs> added this two object, but this is at least anything. So let's do one more thing, perhaps. So what we can do here? I want to import this one to uh, UE five, but could we style this a little bit more? Make the cube a little bit peculiar or something like that. Let's do this. Let's try this. I press uh one on my numpad and then i select all both then i press g to grab set to uh grab along the set axis i move it up and this is just for the pivot point here in the middle and then what we can do here is i don't know i think this looks already good enough <laughs> <laughs> okay let's let's add anything else here let's find something so we can make anything stylish is there anything stylish here not really right we have to make something stylish to do this one i think we just use that i find nothing uh what we can do this is okay and we want test it in unreal engine 5 so that was not a big creation, but okay for this one. So what we do is we go to save S and we call it monkey hat. Ah, uh, what is that? Let's call it monkey hat here. Monkey hat. We save that. All right. We have a monkey. Now export it to Blender. We know let's see we go to export again fpx oh we have to select that oh we made one mistake one mistake i have here two meshes right i have to combine them first so i select both and then i press ctrl g for join and now they are one mesh here that was the mistake almost made this wrong okay now we can save this one more time save uh, not s just save control s cool. and now export it that's it and we go to export our object is selected that's very important then we can select here again select object mesh we did this already but i have to set this up again and forward is my x this time and um, up is my set and apply unit now let's see let's try this with apply units this time apply units and here in geometry we change this one to smoothing face and how much we have nothing should be said nothing and so on and we have no animations and that's it for the settings here on the right side and we go to the folder where we want exported and i have to go to where is my the folder there is it and then i go to documents where is my documents here 
anywhere. No, that's not the right. Ah, I go here to documents and then I go to Unreal projects, for example. And then here is the new, new Lura map. We have to go there this time. This was new released. Unreal Engine 5 official release, a new starter game a map for beginners like us. And here we have to find, of course, the content. And yes, let's do this here. Export. Zack. And that should be. Now I can switch to Unreal. And we have here the import. Let's click it. And we have no missing collision. I will make them myself. The setting here, I, I think I keep here all, right? Oh, almost all. Perhaps. And let's see. Convert scene. No, I don't need that. There is already fine. And I think I keep this. So import. And let's see. So this one should be imported here now. And we go to the content. And here it is imported. What material is this actually? Uh, I did not this material it was imported with this one here. Probably it's OK. So what we do is here's my test folder. We click here on create new folder and we make a static mesh folder static mesh folder. Of course, we drag and drop our new static mesh in our oops in our static mesh folder. Let me open this one here up perhaps. So I can drag and drop it here, move here, perfect. We need a material folder perhaps too. This really reference with that. Let me see the reference fever. And ah yes it is indeed reference with our monkey. Ah, let's make a material folder whatever. And new material and then let's drag and drop our material in our material folder. Uh, move here. And save all. And of course, what we have to do is also fix up redirections in folder. That's it. And now we can test our static mesh. Let's test it. So here is a map. When I start this map. It has nothing in and now let's test our monkey as a decoration system. Let's go rid of this one. Let's open this one and we drop it. And now we have almost our monkey here. Let's move it. And oh, let's place it here anywhere. <laughs> uh, let's place it here or, or let's place it there on top, right? Perhaps here anywhere. We can scale it a little bit bigger here in this case and make a new color uh, material. Yeah, I think we have materials here. I make a rotation a little bit bigger so we can see it. Then I snap it on the ground with end key and rotate it one more time so that we can see <laughs> this one. And let's place it, place it here. It's like funny flying a little bit just for fun we can test uh, we can change this of course too and what we can change here we go here to content we have we have materials here already and of course they don't have here this one we can select here materials and now we have materials here and let's take this material. <laughs> now we have a pink material. <laughs> Say whatever. Let's see perhaps another material. This one is not so. What if, uh, What is this one? This looks. He. It looks animated. That's yeah. Let's test this one. Oh no. Let's drop this one down. That was not so cool as I thought. Oh, not here. Now what I have to do is go here, press end key, press place. Yeah, that's that's now we styled a little bit this starter map <laughs> with our monkey head. We've tested. Yeah, man, that's cool. That's cool. 
and in the next video we create here a little bit more basic assets and make this map more beautiful <laughs> but you see it works we do something perfect so i save this and i stop this video here and in the next video we create a little bit more bye